NAC can actually be helpful for uh, in terms of taking care of, uh, of lung health in general. But I would be looking at something that's getting into the body that's activating a def the defensive system or causing a defensive response. Asthma equals defensive response, okay? Okay. If I can ask you just one more question. Sure. You, I know you talked a lot about nitric oxide. Yes. So I, have this, I know a lot of that pre-workout stuff that people take is kind of like, oh, you know, like I don't yeah. But yeah. if it's a nitric oxide based one, is that are those better or Ni nitric oxide boosters? Is... Are you talking about nitric oxide boosters, right? Not based. There's well, it no has nit nitric oxide in it. Has a lot of caffeine too, and it has other things that's supposed to help. It says I know how you're talking about labeling right now. So when you read the ingredients, the ingredients sound scary, but then the labeling is like focus and energy and yeah, pump and all that stuff. Right, and that's I, marketing. I, you gotta be, you gotta yeah, make a so distinction. Is all that stuff just garbage. Well, I won't. I don't know. You know, you'd have to be. You'd have to tell me specifically. I can't. I can't give you a, a blanket blanket uh, statement on that. I never heard of nitric oxide literally in a supplement, though. I think you're talking about nitric oxide boosters, and usually, Maybe, yeah, because it's like. Have you ever heard of NO explode? That's like nitric oxide. It's supposedly it's a helps booster. Boost yeah, it's a yeah. booster. Most of these involve the amino acid arginine, and arginine is a spectacularly important amino acid, especially for bodybuilders. And not the least of which, for, for a lot of reasons, but not the least of which is the fact that arginine is a precursor. It gets converted into nitric oxide. You want to save some money? Get yourself some arginine. Uh, make sure you're doing about a gram or two of it every day. All bodybuilders should be doing arginine, in my opinion. In fact, all, everybody, if you're interested in anti-aging, you're not going to get arginine in a lot of foods unless you're eating a lot, a lot of meat or high-protein foods. And it's cheap enough and it's easy enough to supplement with. I would be supplementing with arginine. That's the best way to boost your nitric oxide. But keep listening, Brian, because we're going to be talking a lot about nitric oxide in the coming days. Thanks All so right. much. Great, thanks, thank, thank you, thanks, buddy. Man. Thanks for your call, man. Okay, Richard in Texas. Welcome to the Bright Side. Hello, Ben. I'm a first-time caller, but I've listened to your show for a long time and very much appreciate you. Thank you. Um, I would like to suggest, well, one, one thing first. I have a friend who's uh, been an alternative, uh, uh, amazing dental tech for a long time. It's into advanced therapies, but she's moved into the malfacial um, field. and uh, Moved into what field, Richard? Say that again. She's moved into... Maxiofacial. Oh, maxiofacial. Okay, got it. Okay, and uh, she's focused on breathing a lot. And one of the things that she is a really strong believer in her research is that breathing with your mouth closed and actually your tongue up behind your teeth That's great. is uh, extremely important in terms yes. of not only determining facial structure over time, but also producing nitrous oxide. That's absolutely yeah. correct. Absolutely okay. correct. She's a smart woman. The, uh, first of all, she's, that's three very important things. You want to breathe with your mouth closed, always. In through the nose, out through the nose. Mouth is for eating, nose is for breathing. So, so, out through uh, the nose is important, too? In and out through the nose, yes. In and out through the nose. Now, if you need a lot of oxygen, if you're like running a marathon or something, or you just finished running a marathon, you may do, do some mouth breathing. But for the most part, it's in and out through the nostrils. Mouth is for eating, nose is for breathing. The second thing you just said it was really kind of interesting and important is to have your tongue in the back. And actually, you want your tongue kind of contacting the roof of your mouth, especially, yeah. if, you're, especially if you're breathing for relaxation, because there's actually a, a complex of nerves of relaxation relaxation system or parasympathetic system nerves located in the roof of your mouth. And you know what? Even if you just right now, if you tickle the roof of, the roof of your mouth with your tongue, you'll notice, if you're paying attention anyway, you'll notice that you've activated a relaxation response just by tickling the roof of your, uh, of your mouth with your tongue. This is a way of activating the parasympathetic nervous system. This is actually a remedy for hiccups. Uh, for, it can be a remedy for hiccups simply by relaxation, relaxing or activating the relaxation nervous system. And the third thing you said, which was interesting, is the mouth is one of the best ways to get nitric oxide because of bacteria. Bacteria in the mouth actually convert nitrates and nitrates from food into nitric oxide. So once again, those are three wonderful points that your friend brought up. Is that I, I, what is your question? Did you have a question for me? Well, thank you. Yes, and, and I'm glad I brought it up only because you you've educated me even more on the subject. Than, uh, good I'm good deal. Say. Yeah, uh, tell your friend. Thing, kudos to your friend, by the way. Tell her I said that. Her, her name is Carol Vanderstep, and she's been on uh, interviewed on Mercola and stuff like that. She's very interesting. She's enough, spot on. Right? Spot on. Um, anyway, uh, the second thing I wanted to mention is I, I've listened to a lot of your shows. And never really heard as much focus on candida as I would like yeah. to see maybe you address. Yeah, um, I've battled that a long time. And one of the things I learned is, uh, if it's true, is that once it busts out of your gut when you've uh, you know overdone it, so to speak, 
the first place it goes is to your pancreas and partially shuts off the insulin valve out of your pancreas. What an evil thing that is. <laughs> and the self support you know, itself, you yeah. know? Well, here's the thing. Candida is supposed to, under under healthy circumstances, candida is not an enemy. Candida stays in the gut, and it kind of lives in this balance with bacteria. The problem is, number one, when we drink chlorinated water and fluoride, uh, fluoridated water, and we take antibiotics, or we eat antibiotics in our fish and our dairy, etc., these are all ways that we can kill off the gut bacteria. If we're uh, not breastfed long enough, if we've got problems with birth, if we were born cesarean, etc., these are all ways, uh, all, all causes of dysbiosis or messed up gut bacteria. Well, of Once, course, there's the sugar in the grains like you've been focusing all, all on. Of that, <laughs> all of that. All of that tends to throw off the ecosystem in the digestive tract, in the gut, and then the candida overgrow. Once that happens, then you're off to the races. Sugar, th- then the uh, excess ingestion of sugar really feeds the candida. If you have leaky gut, the candida gets into the blood. And uh, the reason I don't talk about candida so much is because it's a secondary problem. It's not a primary problem. The second, I kind of uh, thought it was primary to a lot of things like maybe well, I mean, everything, yes, that's true. It is primary to a lot of things, but it's secondary to dysbiosis. Yes, it can be primary to a lot of mental health issues and physical health issues for sure, but it itself is secondary to messed up gut bacteria. And this is why I focus on the digestive system a lot. Once the candida is out, you can't really kill candida. You know, it's going to keep, it's yeast, it's a microbe, it's going to keep proliferating. I wish we had more time to discuss this. If, if you'd like, call me back tomorrow. We'll continue talking about Candida, Richard. And thanks so much for your kind words. Apologize if we left you on hold. Call us back tomorrow, and we'll get you first up. Tell our call screener we left you on hold. I'm Pharmacist Ben. Thanks for listening, folks. Have yourselves a wonderful, beautiful, spectacular day. We'll talk to you all later, folks. Bye for now. Hi, this is Ted Anderson. Have you ever wondered why banks, stockbrokers, investment advisors won't talk about gold IRAs? They've been available since 1986, yet the financial industry won't recognize the value of gold for your retirement. Gold has outperformed paper investments, yet no word about IRAs. If you would like to have gold for your retirement, call 800-686-2237. Don't get left behind by rising inflation and low returns. Call 800-686-2237. Secure your future and call 1-800-686-2237. Managing your business and customers isn't easy, huh? Snap. Snapforce customer relationship software may be just what you need. Snapforce CRM is a software solution that helps you manage everything important about your customers, from sales to marketing to service and support. All of your customer information is right there at your fingertips for easy access. It's time to take control of your business in a snap. Get your free trial at snapforce.com. That's S-N-A-P-F-O-R-C-E.com. Snapforce.com. If the IRS has garnished your paycheck or seized money from your bank account, you need to get professional tax help now. Fast action is required to put a halt to these aggressive IRS collection tactics. You can count on the knowledgeable team of tax professionals at Wall & Associates. With over 30 years of experience, Wall & Associates has settled the tax problems of thousands of taxpayers for a small fraction of what they owed. For a free face-to-face consultation, call 1-800-425-4610 to put a wall between you and the IRS. 1-800-425-4610 or look for us on the web at wallandassociates.net. We solve tax problems. If you hire Walland Associates today, you'll never have to talk to the IRS again. To stop the levies and seizures today, take action now. Call Walland Associates at 1-800-425-4610. Wall and Associates. 1-800-425-4610.